plan that would expand taxi services and regulate popular ride shares like Uber and Lyft is currently on hold tonight, which isn't sitting well with many taxi drivers who tell WISN 12 News' Melinda Davenport they want the change to happen now. For months, new app-based taxis like Uber and Lyft have been operating in Milwaukee illegally. Well, the lack of regulation for them has angered many taxi drivers who have to pass background checks and pay healthy licensing fees to operate. The Common Council is closer than ever to passing legislation allowing the two to coexist, but so far they haven't put it to a vote, tabling it for another month. It was a very unfortunate uh, to hear that. Taxi drivers like Ishmael Haroun are disappointed. He and other cab drivers want Uber and Lyft drivers to be held to the same standards. We would like to see uh, everyone play by the same rules and uh, everyone uh, goes through the same system. I think it can make the, the resolution, the ordinance better. Legislation before the council now would lift a cap on the number of taxi permits in Milwaukee and regulate rideshare companies by requiring background checks and vehicle inspections for all. The plan would also provide provisional licenses and outsourcing of inspections to speed up the process. We just want to make sure that, that everybody's playing by the same rules, that there's a level playing field for both traditional taxi operators as well as any new competitors that want to enter the market. And we're embracing technology, and we're embracing change, and we're embracing uh, more choices and more transportation options for our citizens. Some council members say they just need a few more weeks to get it right. Melinda Davenport, WISN 12 News. The city currently caps the number of taxi permits at 420. Alderman Bauman says today's proposal would let the free market decide how many taxes are necessary in the city.